For almost two weeks, Los Angeles City Council has gotten nearly nothing done. The city is roiled by charges of racism in high places and two city council members who refuse to resign. CBS's Mark Strassman has more on the power struggle. A melee in L.A. Raucous protesters quashing city council meetings, demanding resignations. This firestorm's over backroom bigotry. Casual racism recorded on a leaked year-old audio tape of three Latino city council members. In Spanish, one calls a white councilman's adopted black son a little monkey. The way he looked like a little white kid, which I was like, this kid is a beat down. Resigning under pressure, city council president Nuri Martinez, apologizing but refusing to step down, councilman Gil Cedillo and Kevin De Leon. I have to do the hard work. I have to regain the trust of my colleagues. It won't be easy. Beyond hard, critics say impossible. He clearly doesn't get, I think, what he did. Councilman Mike Bonin, the father of that adopted little boy. The predecessor to the actual spoken apology has got to be the resignation. And in this diverse sprawl of four million people. This has been a torpedo to the hull of Los Angeles civic life. Zev Yaroslavsky spent 40 years in city leadership, managing its competing interests. It's how you manage it. And you don't manage it by getting in the back room and vilifying people and saying they have horns. It's a mess of broken trust, racial and ethnic fracturing, and a paralyzed city council. The tape was secret, but its fallout is obvious to everyone. Mark Strassman, CBS News, Los Angeles.